Oh no the She didn't <laughs> Jocelyn Hernandez and Wendy Williams Jocelyn really thought that she did something when she decided to show up to the nationally syndicated daytime Emmy Award winning NAACP Image Award multi nominated 13 seasons in the game Wendy Williams show epic fail greetings 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 royal family thanks for clicking on the video and welcome back to those who are returning all right so y'all know wendy williams is my girl all right i am always down to call wendy williams out when she is not right in my opinion but this time jocelyn showed up to her show and thought that she really gathered wendy williams and in my opinion she did not make sure you let me know what you think in the comments now i know a lot of people don't like wendy williams and there's nothing wrong with that right you have your opinions about wendy for whatever reasons but some of those same people who don't like wendy williams of course they found pleasure in seeing jocelyn appear on the show to quote unquote tell wendy williams about herself all right it made for good tv you know i cackled a little bit but I do not think that Wendy Williams got dragged by Jocelyn. It kind of reminded me of a scripted scene from a VH1 production, you know, very predictable, and it lacked substance. So basically, it was for entertainment purposes only. Again, this is my opinion, all right? See, here's the thing, okay? Here's the thing. Jocelyn feels that, you know, Wendy should give her recognition for all that she has done, you know, and... She decided to, you know, let Wendy know how she felt during a interview that was scheduled, right? Wendy, she sat there unfazed, but she, you could tell she started to get annoyed because Wendy got a show to run at the end of the day. Like, Jocelyn, you can, you know, express your grievances, but Wendy has a job to do, her show, you know, to be specific. So I'm not showing the clip because by now you guys should have seen it. If not, it's all over YouTube all over social media. I'm not getting dinged by Debmar, Mercury, and them. I have played Wendy Williams's, um, you know, clips from her show plenty of times. And in post or pre-production, I had to cut it out. So I'm not showing the clip. Anyway, so Jocelyn, she went on and on about Wendy not treating African-American and Hispanic women with respect. Then Jocelyn took digs at Wendy's age. Um, she mentioned, she, she mentioned Wendy no longer being in an abusive relationship and stated that she has the number one show in the country, Jocelyn's Cabaret, which is on Zeus Network. And Wendy's tried to tell her, no, you have the number one show on Zeus Network. She said, I, I, no, I had the number one show in the country. Wendy's like, okay, whatever girl. Okay. Now some parts of it was funny, you know? Um, I just don't think that this was a good look for a woman who claims to be a boss. And I feel like, mm, was Jocelyn trying to trend? Yeah. Did she accomplish her mission? Yeah. But just like one cent bubblegum, ladies and gentlemen, the flavor doesn't last very long. But -ba -ba. Okay. Now, Jocelyn, she used the word we a lot. I don't know if you guys saw the clip. She just kept saying, we are tired of this and we want you to, you know, we got love for you, Wendy. We want you to treat us with respect. And I just want to go on record and say that Miss Hernandez does not, nor ever will speak for me, nor be a representation of me, <laughs> Royal B. Okay. She has her own issues with Wendy and obviously she held a grudge and she waited for the opportunity to be, you know, back on Wendy's show to throw a tantrum and get some attention. Right. Again, mission accomplished. Now, why would the Puerto Rican princess care about Wendy giving her her flowers? Simply because you know Wendy and um, uh, Tiffany, New York Pollard, are the reasons women like Jocelyn can do what she does. Let's just keep it real, okay? Wendy crawled and walked so that Jocelyn Hernandez could twerk. All right, everybody, let me know what you think. And that's on period. Now, here are my final thoughts. I'm gonna wrap this video up because I'm high energy. This iced coffee is speaking to my spirit right now. Let us not forget, right, that Jocelyn, number one in the country, Hernandez, is the same woman 
that accused her ex and the father of her child of harming their child in the most despicable way. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Google it. Let us not forget. Also, Miss Number One told a woman who opened up to her for whatever reason on her show that she committed a double homicide because she terminated a pregnancy she had with twins. Yes, Jocelyn Number One Hernandez told one of her girls on her show that she committed double homicide. Wow. Um, I hope that Jocelyn remembers that, you know, some people love mess. And once the next entertaining mess comes along, we will see if, you know, Jocelyn is the boss that she's proclaiming to be. I'm just saying, once Jocelyn is in the game for 13 years and, you know, constantly or consistently holding the number one title in whatever product that she brands, then she can have a conversation with Miss Wendy Williams, okay? Wendy is not new to this, y'all already know. And the way that she let Jocelyn, you know, throw her tantrum and proceed with the interview says a lot about, you know, Wendy being the master of her craft. You know, she's been called worse by better. Y'all remember when she had it out with Whitney Houston? She let Whitney Houston tear her to shreds. She, during the six week sneak peek of the show, cause I've been watching since day one, Aretha Franklin came on and read Wendy. She was very shady to Wendy and Wendy took it like a champ. Let us not forget the infamous Judge Greg Mathis tore Wendy a new one and she took it all in stride. So if Jocelyn wants her flowers, in my opinion, I think that she should be reaching out to people like Superfly, Huggy Bear, hell, Jerome from Martin. Because you ain't nothing but a glorified pimp, Jocelyn Hernandez. And I'm not knocking your hustle. So we'll see what Jocelyn New Money Hernandez will do with the opportunities afforded to her because of people like Wendy Old Money Williams. That's all I got. Ain't got no more. Drop down in the comments and let me know what you think, royal family. I'm signing off. And as always, until next time, folks, peace.